books that I got, and I am currently reading, hang on, <laughs> Pachinko. Um, I just got Apple TV to see We Crashed, Tehran, and The Morning Show. And I saw an ad for this and I thought it was, I guess not an ad, I saw a trailer for Pachinko, the series that just came out on Apple TV. And I thought it was amazing, so I didn't realize it was a book before. And I just looked into it and then just got it quickly at my bookstore. And I'm reading this. Love it. Very, very love it. I just, I like how it's written. You can really escape. I've missed my subway stop twice so far because of this book, so highly recommend. Oh yeah, I don't think I mentioned this on my channel, but I ran the half marathon of Paris and um, this is actually something that Chloe, I'll write, link, whatever, her channel somewhere. Um, I really like her. She's Swiss and she's living in South Africa right now and she runs uh, marathons, semi-marathons. She mentioned she did triathlons also, so she recommended this book. So what I talk about when I talk about running. Um, she just mentioned it quickly, it has dust on it. So this is short, I'll probably uh, try to read this after I get back from Milan because I'm going to Milan. I have too much to catch up on. Um, but first, the third book, so I'm Iranian and apparently this is a classic to read. It's called Towards Isfahan. And I just finished my beginner's Farsi course, which was three and a half months long through the University of Tehran. And that was really hard. I think I was the only one that was not a student or didn't have a job or whatnot, so I was struggling a bit. But I finished it and I have two more levels. As I wanna say most of you know on this channel, I just started this channel to keep my grandmother up in the loop who recently passed away. So I don't want to force myself to vlog. I just wanna vlog when I can. I have my own business and it takes a lot of my time. So it's really hard to do both, but if I'm taking time off, I might have the time. Plus it might be fun for me and my friend to have some memories. So I'll let you know. I'm pretty satisfied with it just because I was in don't mind my patch um I was in my father's office it just wasn't inspired over there so I had to move um I am looking at the pictures from last night's dinner and my friend made me wear these glasses they were awesome so you put them on and then everything is heart shaped with light so let me just show you what it looks like. And therefore, I'm going to order a pair of these glasses. <laughs>
don't feel like putting makeup on. So I'm breaking out here. I have been breaking out here for a very long time, like just here and that's it, just because it feels like it. Cool. Um, also my little scars here from the flu. I'm not gonna get in detail. <laughs> but um, I'm just wearing a blazer and a lace top underneath. And the sleeves are really cool because they're like long and they go over. Uh, I'm being very minimalist. Um, it's freezing outside, so I'm just going to wear a big coat and this and that's it. And it's time to go to Bambini. I feel like when your hair is done, you don't really need to do like crazy stuff. So maybe I don't need mascara. I have long lashes anyways, but 